Tonight, Community Regional Medical Center's CyberKnife is an exciting new painless, knifeless surgical tool that is treating cancer and playing a significant role in future medicine. Physicians, nurses, and Valley patients are taking part in leading-edge studies that can make a difference in the lives of others. Community Medical Centers is paving the way with their groundbreaking CyberKnife research. Registered nurse Bonnie Harkins coordinates CyberKnife studies. There's different phases to studies. Some of the studies that we have going on right here in the CyberKnife department are pilot studies that are originating here. They're only being done here at, at our department in Fresno. They're um, nowhere else in the world. Other studies are cooperative type efforts among other sites all around the country. Community Regional Medical Center was the first in the world to offer G4 CyberKnife technology. What is CyberKnife? That's, that, that's a common question. It, it's a very precision uh, medical surgical tool and it uses uh, pencil beams of x-rays to target, track, and, and treat tiny lesions uh, anywhere throughout the body. The cyber knife is a new technology. It is an enabling technology. It is so enabling that it's um, brought some investigators, some very smart minds, to think about new paradigms of approaching old problems. Bonnie Harkins is one of those smart minds. We have um, CyberKnife clinical trials open right now. We're actively accruing, and we have um, patients being enrolled on. We have a lung study for early lung cancer. We also have a prostate study and we have a study for breast cancer. 20 staff members from community medical centers volunteered to be part of an exciting new study on atrial fibrillation or abnormal heart rhythm. Within a two week period we had, we were inundated with phone calls, people wanting to volunteer for this study. So these study volunteers that we have are undergoing um, x-rays. They're having some um, cardiac CT scans done and then they're coming down to the cyber knife department and they're having some cyber knife images done. And then we're going to overlay these two and see if we can compare them. Registered nurse and clinical analyst Lorraine Vargas is one of the volunteers. I felt that if we had the opportunity and we could do it for our organization, as well as the community, that was a plus. That's more of like the professional reason why. It's also personal. Atrial fibrillation affects Lorraine's family. Whoever is going to need this type of treatment, once it's fully developed and analyzed, they are going to benefit. They're going to benefit, as what I understand, is it's not going to hurt very much compared to our current day treatment. We're looking at the heartbeat, the motion of the heart. We know that we have the technology for the cyber knife to move with the respiration, but we don't know about the heartbeat. Patients are amazed by cyber knife because it is knifeless and painless. The X-ray beams deliver large doses of radiation to destroy tumors in fewer visits than traditional treatment. One of our treatment trials that we have ongoing right now is the application of uh, CyberKnife radiosurgery for early prostate cancer. And our experience locally has mirrored the national experience uh, very, very well. And what we're finding is that for the correct gentleman with early prostate cancer, uh, we're finding that the, the men really like this treatment option. While research takes many years, today's treatments are made possible by yesterday's volunteers. I would love to see that time, perhaps in my lifetime, where if myself or my loved one is diagnosed with cancer, one, it's early, before it's symptomatic, before it causes any problems, and before any disruption occurs, the non-invasive outpatient treatments can be um, applied and the cure is achieved in a matter of weeks to months with minimal disruption to lifestyle and quality of life. Many of Community Medical Center's CyberKnife studies continue to show promise thanks to the heart of the volunteer and passionate medical experts.